So how much does it cost to charge your Tesla? Is it expensive? Does it bring up your bill? How long can you go without charging again? These are questions I get all the time, and today we'll find out the answers. Stay tuned. What's poppin' with Scoochie guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be finding out exactly how much I'm paying to charge my 2020 Tesla Model 3 Standard Range Plus. And if you enjoy these Tesla videos, make sure to smash that like button down below so that viewers like you can find out the answers to these common questions. So I've gotta tell you guys from the start, driving, operating, and charging a Tesla is significantly cheaper than driving and filling up gas in a traditional ICE vehicle. Before I made the switch to my 2020 Model 3, I was driving a 2014 BMW M235i in which I'd be spending $200 to $250 every single month just in gas. And ever since I made the switch, I've literally been saving hundreds of dollars back into my pocket. Now let's dive into the numbers. To figure out approximately how much it costs you per month to charge a Tesla, you honestly just need to put the numbers into an equation. For this example, we'll just be taking a look at my 2020 Tesla Model 3 Standard Range Plus. So for a little bit of background, my 2020 Tesla Model 3 contains about a 56 kilowatt hour battery pack. When charged to 100%, it contains about 250 miles of range. In order for you to calculate how much it'll cost you to charge your Tesla, you first have to approximate how many miles you typically drive on a given month. Once you have that number down, multiply it by the battery pack of the car, in which this case is 56 kilowatt hours, and then you take that and divide it by the maximum amount of range in the car, which in this case is 250 miles. That'll give you your total kilowatt hour usage. Then it gets really simple here. All you have to do is figure out how much it'll cost you per kilowatt hour. So you can find this in your electricity bill, in the public charging stations, at your local supercharger, etc. Now all I have to do is take that 270, multiply it by 20 cents, since that's typically how much I pay per kilowatt hour, and that should give me a total of around $54 per month. And that's the total amount of money that I would be spending for charging. One thing that I did want to disclaim to you guys is that I primarily do charge at work and there's a reason for that. So currently I live with two different housemates at the moment and our electricity bill is not optimized for electric vehicles just due to all fairness. So the difference between charging at work and charging at home is about a six cents difference. So that's the reason why I primarily charge at work. But in either case, I do save about $150 to $200 every single month. In addition to this, I sometimes supercharge my Tesla whenever I go out with the places with the supercharging stations. For example, when I went to Santana Row in my previous vlog, I was able to charge my car completely free by heading up to the fourth level of the parking garage and just simply plugging my car in. And this was because I had some supercharging miles that I received through referrals. Sure, it's not every day that I receive free supercharging, but it's just a little added bonus for whenever I do visit the places with the supercharging stations. If you want a thousand free supercharging miles, make sure to click the link below in the description before you order your Tesla. Well guys, now you have the secret formula to calculating how much it'll cost you to charge your Tesla. So tell me, do you own a Tesla? If so, how much are you saving by switching to fully electric? And if not, how much will you save by switching to an electric vehicle like a Tesla? As always, leave a comment down below on what other kind of videos you want to see on the channel, whether it be vlogs, day in my lives, Tesla videos, and also make sure to subscribe if you haven't yet and turn on a little bell so you can stay tuned for what's next. Thank you guys so much for swinging by. See you later. Peace.